Last Wednesday night, book lovers joined together for a lecture about the evolution of bookbinding and how it has changed in society today. The Canadian Authors Association branch in the Waterloo area brought in guest speaker Dan Spezza of the Canadian Bookbinders and Book Artists Guild to talk about the construction of books and book repairs. For over 20 years, Dan Spezza has repaired and restored old books by hand. During his lecture, Spezza passed around books from different time periods that he constructed himself. What, what has happened um, coming up from the, uh, <coughs> the simple wooden board covering, they've actually, you, you have the text box. Now this one is papyrus. Um, again, uh, and the boards are papyrus. The Canadian Authors Association Waterloo Wellington Branch President Vanessa Richie Theode says that she got a lot out of the presentation and hopes others did too. I love books, all kinds of books. I love old books, I love new books, I just love books. And I, I'm really fascinated to see older books. It was really neat to learn the history of books. I mean, I've, obviously I know a little bit of it, but not, not the whole thing. So it was really cool to see what he had to say and learn more about older books and how they're made. And I kind of want to take some of those workshops he was talking about, maybe make my own books or own paper. How cool would that be? So. The Canadian Authors Association helps protect the rights of authors and their works. Spezza said that the quality of books has changed from being homemade to being mass-produced. The deterioration of quality of, of the bindings and what's being produced today. Um, uh, often I'll see people bringing books that are not four or five years old and they're falling apart and they've paid you know, $150 for the book. Um, and you know, it's just the, the workmanship is so bad. And, and the uh, the construction of modern stuff, yeah. For Spoke Online, I'm Jessica Hammer.